We could not have been more excited to receive the Gold Award recognition. For us as Broadland Council and South Norfolk Council, we are really, really supportive of our veteran community and our service personnel. And this recognition puts a big banner above our organisation. We've set up a number of different ways of supporting current military personnel and former military personnel. We make sure that former and current members of the armed forces have access to possible employment opportunities. When it comes to current employees, we make sure that those who are reservists have access to all the development and support they need and the time made available to them to fulfil uh, the role of being a reservist. Those people who are current former military personnel have access to housing should they need access to housing. So we make sure that by virtue of being affiliated with the armed forces, they have access to higher priority bands, which means they're more likely to get the home that they need for them and their family. And then we also do quite a lot of work in the community to make sure that organisations like the cadets have the support that they need to be successful. So that includes things like giving them 100% relief on their business rates, but also through our member award grant schemes, we're giving access to um, POTS of money that might help them develop their own support lines to their own uh, membership. We've got the gold standard. The thing for us now is to really, really make that come alive and be a core part of the way we do business so that anybody in the armed forces who lives and works in Norfolk knows that we're a place that they can come and approach us, work with us, or come and approach us for support and they will be welcomed with open arms.